everyone. Thank you so much for checking out Crafty Little Rosebud here on YouTube. Today we have an Erin Condren haul for you. And as you can see, I've got this huge box here. Um, beautiful green color. Um, let me get everything out and then um, I'll kind of explain the order a little bit and then we'll jump right into it. So give me just a moment and I'll be right back once I get rid of this big old box. Okay, so box aside, they did wrap it in the tissue paper. My order was a bit big for that. Um, we've got this little purple label here, and then of course you've got that there. Um, and it looks like the typical postcard was tucked into my tissue paper. So here it says, be fearless in the pursuit of what sets your soul on fire. And I'll get rid of the crinkly stuff and um, set the stuff to the side and then just kind of show you one thing at a time. So as always, um, be sure to check out the description below. I'm going to take these out of the package, kind of go through the description real quick. Um, I will have my referral link to Erin Condren down there. That gets you $10 off your first purchase of Erin Condren if you use that. And it also gives me a $10 kickback, which um, I can use to bring you all hauls like this. I've also got um, various referral um, links down there as well to other shops that get you discounts. And I do have my current PR code. It's Rosebud20 from Megan Renee Plans. That'll get you 20% off of her website. She is also on Etsy. Um, and let's see, I've got links to my social media down there as well. And I think that's all. So we'll go ahead and jump into this. Um, the biggest items, which is why my box was so big, is I ordered two sets of the placemats. I thought these would be good um, backgrounds to use when I don't want to continue to use this um, table runner that you see in a lot of my videos. So I grabbed these and they are customized. So I got this one here and I think it was the eucalyptus, I believe is the name of the design. I don't remember what color choices I chose, but I got this background color here and then the color of the petals are the ones you get to choose. And of course, I got Crafty Little Rosebud on it. Now these, they're just multiple pages of paper. I figured they would make a good background in some of my photos as well as some of my videos. So I got that. And then I couldn't decide between the two. So I got this one as well. Uh, this one is double thick. Okay, so, um, I could feel a major difference between the two and what I'm noticing, well, I'll show you in a minute. So this is the second design I picked out. And again, I got Crafty Little Rosebud down there in the corner. And I just kind of wanted to go with lighter colors to kind of, um, contrast. So this way I've got a set of darker colors and a set of lighter colors. And then this one felt especially thick. And what I just realized is I got two. Now I need to double check and make sure I didn't actually order two of this. Oh, sorry. That I didn't actually order two sets of this eucalyptus design. I think that's what it is. That's what I'm going to call it. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry. But they did send me two sets. So I'm gonna make sure that I didn't actually pay for two, and if I did, then it's my mistake and I've got a double set of this, which is fine. I just don't know what I'm gonna use it for. So this one happened to have two sets in it. But those are the two de designs that I chose, and I just thought they would be great backgrounds. And the placemats, um, I know originally I thought that they were going to be like a hard plastic like placemat you would have for a table. They're not. They are just a very thick um, cardstock. So I got those. Let's get those set aside. And then I ordered a bunch of other goodies. And those placemats definitely take up a good amount of space. So I ordered this all occasion stationery set. Um, I really wanted to get this box so that I could put other cards in it. Um, I will go ahead and say that the paper here is kind of peeling up, so I'm gonna have to glue that down. But um, I thought this would be good just to hold all my little cards and it also comes with cards. So I'll kind of show you those real quick. Oh, it also comes with dividers, which is very nice. So it's got this plastic cover here. I'm gonna get that to slide up. I might actually keep that in there. And it looks like it, they gave us some labels here. 
in um, various colors. Sorry, I'm trying to make sure I stay in frame and the lighting is okay. So let's see. We've got a variety of colors and then we've got tabs for, let's put those back in. I'm going to try to keep this t as together as possible. So we've got tabs for birthday, thanks, congratulations, inspire, and support. And I'll set that aside and just kind of pull out what is in each. So this was the birthday section. It's got three blank envelopes. We've got let's celebrate and they are blank on the inside and they're foiled. We've got happy birthday and happy birthday. All right, so that goes back in the birthday tab. And then in the thanks tab, I'm just gonna pull the cards out. You don't need to see the plain envelopes. You've got so very thankful for you. Uh, thank you very much and thank you. That one is foiled. They are all foiled, it looks like. All right. And then in the congrats, you've got congrats to you. And so the adventure begins and the best is yet to come. Again, all foiled. And then in inspire, um, you've got this. It's a good day to have a good day and do more of what makes you happy. And then for support, and this is the last one, I promise we're almost done with this part. Um, without change, there would be no butterflies. Get well soon. And be bold, be strong, and fight on. And actually seeing this one, um, there's a woman at work I think this would be perfect for. So I think I'm gonna set that one aside for her. Um, she's currently going through some health issues and um, she's a very strong individual and I just think that would be, she would really enjoy that. Um, then next I got some tabs and let me zoom in here a bit instead of trying to hold everything up to the camera. Okay. And I am doing this one handed so excuse me on the shakiness. So I got two sets of tabs. These I got for my academic planner. Um, I'm kind of using it a little bit differently than you normally would. I'm only setting it up for when I am taking classes, not during the breaks of classes. So um, I needed duplicates of some of these. And these are just the monthly ones. Let me get those out of the package so you can see them a little bit better. Um, the way the lighting is in here, they do tend to glare. So there is the days of the week. Go and I'm trying to use natural lighting, so hopefully everything shows up well for you all. And then here are just some other tabs. Um, they've got the adhesive foil on them, and I just thought they were very pretty. So I grabbed those in case I need extra tabs. All right, and then I grabbed an extra set of these um, pen holders. I really like the fact that you get three in a pack, and um, I tend to like to just keep one of these on almost every cover I have. That way I can always just slide a pen in there if I'm not carrying a planner folio around. And then I got another one of these stencils here. Um, I really like the one I already had and I kind of keep it in one planner folio, but I didn't have any from my other planner folios. So I grabbed another one to keep on hand. I got some more of these dividers here because they work really well for these um, storage boxes. Let me get one out. For these storage boxes here, and I've got one of each of the patterns and this one here, I don't have any dividers yet, so I needed another set. My daughter's gonna drum in the background. Um, so I got another set of those. And then I really wanted to try this sticker book out. I had seen it um, in a haul from Jen Plans. And then I also grabbed this one as well. Um, I'll finish going through the items and then I will do a quick little flip through of these for you all. 
And then next I got some sticker sheets here. I grabbed this pumpkin one. Um, I really liked it and so I wanted to grab that. And then I got this for my wedding planner. It says you are my today and all of my tomorrows and I just really liked it. So I grabbed that to put in my wedding planner. And then I grabbed this for Christmas, Holly Jolly. I'm not sure if I'm actually gonna use it this year or not, but again, I really liked it. And with the sale Erin Condren had going on, it was worth it to go ahead and get it. And then I got these fall leaves here. Again, not sure I'll use it this year, but I liked it. Uh, give thanks with a grateful heart. So I grabbed those because they were a really good deal. And then last on the items that I got, I got myself another planner folio. Let me get that open. And now that I'm looking at it, I actually don't like the colors I picked, but that's okay. Um, so it has way more of a green hue to it than it did on the screen, so I don't love it. Um, I might keep it and use it. I might actually um, do this for a giveaway just because I don't love it as much as I did on the screen or as much as I do my placemat. I do love the um, medium sized um, uh, planner folios. They're absolutely phenomenal. Um, I just don't love the pattern as much with the colors that I picked, so we'll see. I might keep it, I don't know. Okay, and then as for the sticker books, let me get those out of the packaging and we'll kind of flip through them. I'm sure there's other flip throughs of them. Um, so this is just, I guess, more for me than anything. Um, so you're welcome to stick around and I will do a flip through of the two sticker books. Or if you're done watching this haul, you've already seen the sticker books, then thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed my haul. Oh, so first we'll go through the A-plus style sticker pad. Um, let's get that unstuck. So you've got these. Yeah. So you've got these note to self stickers up here. You've got the little rulers, the pins. Um, let's see. Is that a little bit better? Okay, and then you've got no school, time to grade. Yeah, time to grade won't really matter for me, but I guess I could use that when I'm waiting on grades from my class. And then you've got these tabs up here. Again, not sure how I'll use them, but I did really like them. And let's see, I'm getting stuff stuck. There we go, this way you can see the full page. It is sideways, but at least you can see the full page. So let me go ahead, I'll show you this full page again. Got to work with my camera angle here. All right, and then you've got the little apples and you've got some page flags here. Again, the apples I can just use to mark school specific things in my horizontal. You've got little stars. And then you've got meetings. And again, they won't apply for school for me, but I do have meetings at work. And then you've got these little two, so I can list birthday parties on that. Um, since I don't actually attend classes, I'm an online student, I could put, you know, what time I want to work on class or something like that. And then um, I really like these little lists here and you could check it off here or put dates and write the assignment, however you want to do that. I thought these were cute as well. They're like little clipboard kind of things with the clip on the top and you've got big day and take note, so busy, you got this and it does have that foiling. All right, and then we've got some big flags here. Follow your dreams, live, love, learn, believe in yourself. A lot of these aren't specific to school, which is really nice. Today's your day, great job, love this. Um, teach, inspire, guide, mentor, encourage, motivate. So I mean, just lots of very pretty designs here that don't have to be for school. Um, better an oops than a what if, I really like that. Uh, forget the mistake and remember the lesson, strive for progress, not perfection, be positive, patient, and persistent. Teaching is tough, but so are you. So very cute washi strips there. And then I really like these watercolor apples. Have no idea what I would use them for, but they're very pretty. 
And so you've got just different kind of icons. All right, we've got days of the week here. And then we've got some empty boxes down here. Uh, lots of small little icons, um, the asterisk, apple, stars, check marks, hearts, and little stars again. And then we've got our letter stickers here in gold foiling. We've got some rose gold. And that is all that is in that. So, I mean, it, you don't have to be a teacher to use that, which is nice. You don't even have to be a student to use a lot of it. And then this other one, this is the um, Classic Collection Edition 3. Um, and I really love that this kind of matches the um, uh, all of the colors of everything else, like the box that I got and the, um, oh, what's it called? The Perpetual Calendar. All right, so we'll kind of go through this. You've got follow your bliss. Good things happen to those who hustle. Let's do this. Hello, lovely. Some page flags. Little boxes you can write in. And then we've got some checklists, some little page flags again, some little small boxes, some little half circles down here with the foiling. Same layout, just different color foil here. And then let's see, note to self, uh, happy birthday, make it happen, thanks, page flags. Similar layout, just different color foil here. All right, and then XOXO, happy everything, hello sunshine. So just some text, some little flags over here. You had me at hello, happy birthday, date night party. HBD. Happy birthday, maybe? I have no idea. Uh, don't forget, so much love. And then you've got some like gift tag kind of stickers here, which are really cute. I'll definitely use these with some upcoming baby showers and birthdays. And you got some page flags at the bottom. And then you've got some more flags of different sizes. These have words on them, so so much fun. Thanks, congrats, ooh la la, note to self, to do. It's very cute. And then again, similar layout, just a different color foil here. And I hope I'm showing off the foil pretty well. And then this page I was extremely excited about. You've got your little teardrops, but you've also got these washi strips. And I really like this one. It says, create, be brave, motivate, be you, inspire. Just kind of all the Erin Condren words. And then you've got your uh, painted petals down here. And then here is another one, just different foiling. And the washi pages definitely got me. Those were what I was most excited for. And then I really like this too because you've got all your icons and it's in the um, rose gold. I think that's rose gold. Yeah, rose gold. It's kind of hard to tell with the lighting here sometimes. And then that's just the back of it. Okay, so if you stuck around this long, what I am going to do is I am going to give away this planner folio here. Um, I do like it. The more I look at it, the more it grows on me. But I absolutely love the planner folios and I would love to share one. And since you took the time to watch my video, I definitely want to share it with you. Okay, so to win this, I am going to make a couple of requirements. You must like this video. That'll be number one. You must um, comment below with what your favorite type of planner is. It does not have to be Erin Condren. And then for an additional entry, you must go and like or go and follow my Instagram page, which is crafty little rosebud underscore plans. And you can comment below with what your Instagram handle is. That way I can search it and make sure you're following me for the extra entry. So that is the three require, well, the two main requirements is like this video and comment below with your favorite. But for an additional entry, you can also go and follow me on Instagram and comment with what your username is so I can double check and make sure that you are in fact following me on there. I will close this giveaway on, let's see, all these planners and no calendar out. I 
will close this giveaway on October 12th um, at noon. And I will draw a winner on October 12th after noon. That's 12 p.m. Eastern time. And I will notify the winner and they will have 24 hours to respond so that I can get it shipped on the 13th. If they do not respond, I will draw a second winner on the 13th and so forth until we get a winner. So that is what we are going to do. I wish all of you luck. And again, I appreciate you so much for taking the time to watch my video. Have a great day. Bye.